So we're going to have a look at how we can extract data from microdata on a website. So I've got a little Java bit of Java code that we can use. I'm just going to cut and paste this into the well, into Eclipse. So I've cut the code into uh, the into Eclipse and it's all pretty much ready to go. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to use this website here which has a sample of microdata within it. We're then going to use take that in line by line remove the spaces, the speech marks, sorry and then we're going to add, break the text up based around span item prop. So in that website, it basically does this. <coughs> puts my name up, puts job title, where, where I work, and so on. This is what the actual code looks like. We've got spam item prop name, which we can pick apart a little bit more. We've got profession, job title, and so on. Okay. Thing to note is we're splitting this up based around spam item prop. So it's going to take this bit, then write and precise. Span item prop equals speech marks are gone. So we're going to be left with this bit, the name, the greater than sign, strongs, and so on, and uh, spam, backslash spam, and so on. We're only interested in this bit, so we need to do something about that. We don't want the rest of this. So what we do is we take this line by line, split everything up based around the span item prop, and we're left with, and we run it, things like name and greater than sign all this rubbish then uh, spam we need to we want to get rid of this we want to get rid of this I really want to get rid of this as well so this is just a string so what we do is we say well I want to remove these I want to start at this. So in the code, I want to start at this one, go all the way up to here. I don't want to take this, include it in when it's printed out, so I'm going to get rid of this, which means I have to take it back the whole length of this string minus about 16 characters to get back to here. And we can do the same with job title. This time we just need to remove these first few here. So we start at character 9 and we take off 7 to get back to here. So all we're doing is cutting out we're keeping the middle bit of the string, if you like. And we can keep doing this for whatever we want to extract. So, works for address, 
postal code and so on. So that's the first part of that. This just prints them out so we can see what we're pulling out. Oops, excuse me. The next stage is we want to turn it into an XML just because I want to do process it. It's just an example of processing it. I want to take what we've got, extract it, and make an XML document out of it. So that's what I'm doing here. I've created a root node called it address one. I've created a node called name and I've attached that node to the root. It hasn't got anything in there, but it's got the it will when we carry it out in XML it will have the XML tag name. I need to put some text in there. Well I just extract the first thing that I took out from here which is the name and just add that in. So that's now attached to that node which is attached to the root node. And we can keep doing that. And then we save the file as an XML file. So you can see what's happened here. We've got an XML document. It should render properly in a browser. Address one. And then name, job title, employer are all rendered as XML.